because I never put, aside from dyeing it, I was never the type of person to put like gel in my hair or anything like that. I always use like the healthy moisturizers with olive oil you want to do shit like that. Lot. Yeah, no. exactly. Every single one of them is a lot. Uh-huh. Um, That's what <laughs> happens when you live, live in the Bronx. Yeah. Uh, it's men like this. Crazy. <laughs> I'm record like I was actually recording and I caught oh, really? what he said really? the whole thing. That okay, you lady. Uh huh. Yeah, <laughs> lady and gentlemen. Um, this is what it is to live in the Bronx, New York. Yeah, and then this is what it is when you have a friend that just says, uh huh. <laughs> um, but what's up, guys? Welcome to BB's channel. I know y'all were hearing our conversation and my phone. People like that, you know, you gotta pray for people like that, you know? Like, all jokes aside, it's crazy out here. This world is getting insane. Um, but yeah, so right now, right quick, I wanted to say how come when you have to go out and run chores, you're like, uh, I'll leave it for another day. But then, me, I'm talking about myself, I'm about to talk bad about myself right now. But then me, I come out to get coffee. Make it make sense. It just doesn't make any sense. But you know what that means? That coffee is more important than <laughs> running errands. At least for me. So yeah, it's um, a cloudy day in New York and people are making lines for food. That's what's up. I used to do that before actually. Really? Mm-hmm. Um, but yeah. I that when I was younger. I was staying online with my aunt. Yeah. Yeah. My uncle would do it, but it was more like... Got my coffee. <laughs> Sometimes it's important to step out for what's important <laughs> for you, for your mental health. And this, ladies and gentlemen, this is it. Yes? I can watch it. Why nobody warn me that these kids are annoying? <laughs> My little kiddo. Sick. Get get you. I don't want. I don't want. I don't want you guys. Look at <laughs> Why do you think you deserve your phone? They couldn't enter the promised land, and he had them what? wander the deserts for 40 years. <laughs> because you did what? <laughs> After 40 years, God led the children of the 12 tribes back to the promised land. But instead of it being a time of it's joy, being a mom. the Israelites were full of sadness. <laughs>
is my munchies. Who doesn't love the original sunflower seeds? Like, come on. Anyway, so I wanted to, like, okay, story time? I don't know. But, um, so today I called the place for my father and some young girl answered. Let me not assume that some, all right, some young woman or whatever as the phone and she sounded really frustrated on the phone um and her words were dragging which was kind of funny because i was like okay um but yeah so she was just like hello um how can i help you today and i was like hey you know just regular just telling her you know what was the the issue that i was having and i'm still holding up myself um and she goes so we finished you know whatever she helped me you know she was like she was helpful and i told her hey you know i know this i know this has nothing to do with anything right now but i have to say this right quick she was like yes and i'm like making the face like i was there um and I go, God loves you. Like, you don't have to be religious. I'm not religious. And I'm just letting you know that God loves you. And I think everyone should know that too. And her tone changed, like, completely. Like, she was, like, quiet. And then she said, thank you. I really appreciate that. So, you know, I'm not going to lie. I was, like, a little frustrated at first because I was, like, what's the issue, you know? But I was, like, No. I, I can do better than that, you know, whatever she's going through, you know, she's going through, everyone is going through something, you know, so who am I to, you know, feel some type of way that she feels some type of way, right? I don't know, but she helped me and then she she was super nice at the end, so that's pretty cool, you know, just to spread love, you know, it's enough that we're all going through something, you know. So, yeah, I just wanted to share that real quick. And I'm still holding up my sunflower seeds. Anyway, so I'm going to actually end the vlog here. Um, I know it's not really much that I'm sharing with you guys, but bear with me. I am trying. And, yeah, just support your girl, you know. And don't forget to like and subscribe. That would be super awesome. You guys following me. Yay. But yeah, so don't forget to like and subscribe. But subscribe. And I guess I'll see you guys at another vlog. Peace out.